morning guys there really isn't much to vlog today because where are we going to the um doctors or whatever hospital we're going to the hospital again to see hospital, laura hospital see how she's doing and and getting breakfast on pretty the much when when somebody ends up in the hospital that's all you do spend your whole time in the hospital yeah which guys Never want to go to the hospital. It's boring there. Boring. Boring, but you have to go, right? Boring, no internet. But if they had internet, it would be a lot better. I cried last night. You did? Why? Because I think you were overtired. No. What time did you go to bed? You went to bed early, too. She went to bed at like 11. 10 o'clock. Yeah. It was because mom wasn't there. Yeah. We are on our way to the hospital. Yeah. We got my ice cap at the wrong place. Got the ice cap at the wrong place because we stopped and get Laura ice cap and it was like way better. Like, like look. Like look. way better. Way better. Look. Filled. So much ice cap in the... So much look. toppings. And we uh, forgot yesterday to bring a toothbrush and some other stuff. So that's what we're doing. We're on our way to the hospital. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. I have... I have my trusted hairdresser here. She's taking care of me. She wants to do my hair and I just let her. It feels amazing. I. She probably can't do it by herself. Yeah. Good morning guys, welcome to today. I noticed um, in yesterday's video my face looks really red. Is my face red? I don't feel like it's red. Is it red? Was right it could be it because it's just really hot in this room but anyway um good morning welcome to today today was day three of my break and i had a little bit of a rough day i was crying to my doctor crying this morning because i was all alone like my family just leaves me alone for all day like half day like i woke up at 6 30 and guys mom's actually proud that i wore just black and I always have like a love shirt on. Uh, mom's always, mom's proud that she, she changed her clothes and looked presentable today. No. 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 She wore galaxy pants with a white shirt. Anyway, I'm, I'm just right. kidding. Like, I know that they can't be here all the time. But it's just hard. Like, it's hard being lonely. Nice yeah. So, Sam brought, bought this chair. This chair it like you push the button it lays completely back and, it looks, yeah, yeah. and it's leather so it can be washed and um it, i can sleep in it when i go home and also you push the button and it takes you straight to standing which is going to be really useful um because i can't go home until i have a bed on the first floor i have to be able to get to the washroom and stuff oh, i'm not actually able to get up to go to the washroom by Wait, myself would, would that be your bed yeah it's gonna be my bed so you know what? It's gonna be Christmas holidays. It's gonna be amazing because the girls are all good. Yeah, the, what? They already fighting over my new bed. Um, we bought her four packs of gum. Also, I really want I to like keep gum. one pack for me. Yeah. Um, yesterday people brought me five chocolate bars. Different people brought me five chocolate bars. I was like, I have five chocolate bars. I didn't eat any. I looked in there today, and there's two. I have two chocolate bars left. Anyway. So you ate them. I didn't eat any. It's weird. The nurses, nurses must be eating it. Anyways, I just, I just sometimes like when you're in the healing process, sometimes the time comes where you just feel sorry for yourself. Like it's hard for me because I can't do anything. Like, like I, I, before they left, I had everything brought to me. I had like my night table brought right up close to me. My other table brought close to me. I had the TV brought close to me. They tied my phone cord here because I can't get anything. So if one of those things like changes, and I'll just be sitting here like with nothing for the whole until somebody comes. And um, so the lady came to take my blood this morning and she moved my TV and I couldn't reach it. So uh, like, it's just really hard. Like, and it seems so silly to just be complaining about that. Um, still working on pain control. The doctor told me this morning that it's gonna take about two weeks just to get my pain under control. But in the end of two weeks, I should have like some pretty good, like my pain shouldn't be so bad. I'm hoping to go home um, next week sometime. He said maybe, and I'm making huge strides. Anyway, um, draining money. Yeah, I have to still pay Fiona. Like I've not even paid Fiona for my lesson. Uh, have you guys talked to Fiona about booking your lessons again? No. Yeah. I'm so not like. Them. Yeah. I'm you, not riding no, crazy mare. No, you're not. You're no. the ride storm. Guys, I keep getting, let's eat. Let's eat. So this is my lunch for the day. Are you gonna try it? I'm gonna try this. All right, try it. Usually the food has no flavor. 
Hot. Is it good though? What is yeah, it, oh, it is hot. Beans. Pasta. Good. And I have some peaches or some pears, pears I mean. Pears. So I'm not home, so the girls are like, they're not washing their hair. They're probably staying up late. Like, okay. even if I'm home, I can like get things done by you making them up. do the things they need That's to do. That's why we went to bed early last night. You went to bed early last night? 10.30. And then they slept till 10.30. Anyways, so um, my update is that the nurses are really happy with my progress. My doctor is happy with my progress. I'm like itching to go. Like I learned how to roll over for the bedpan. I learned how to position my legs so that I don't even scream anymore. And I also um, only Fish need one nurse. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see, but I have my legs bent kind of up like I can pull my legs well, up really to myself. Walk. Yeah. Sophie's been crying every night. I like it, it's terrible. Uh -huh. And I knew she was gonna cry and I miss I miss them. You know who I really miss? Sophie. Levi. I miss Levi so much. Like I know your puppy. I miss my my dog. You guys could probably bring him. Yeah, He's like I just small enough to fit inside I miss my backpack. My dog. I miss going to the barn. Like the girls, I didn't get to watch the you video because there's no internet bring? here. You so know who we couldn't bring? The emotional support animal. Yeah, I need Levi. an emotional support bird. I have an emotional support bird. Like, I have even a carry case for him. They brought me these flowers that said thinking of you. Um, Nick's been coming every day, which has been really helpful. Um, I took those flowers out. They have, like, these other really good ones. But I thought pink was the way to go. Yeah, pink is always the way to go. This one that I take makes me kind of feel sick, so I don't feel like eating too much. Um... Yeah, so I've not been so maybe God saying Laura you need to lose some weight um, So you can ride your horse So I'm gonna break your hip in a lot of different places and your tailbone so that you can go to the hospital Stay there for a while and lose weight. Maybe that's the plan. Maybe that's God's plan Anyway, so back to my update. I keep getting distracted, but um, they're happy with my progress They think I might get to go home next week and uh, Sam ordered that bed for me. It's coming when on the 19th Wednesday Wednesday. It's coming on Wednesday, so I don't think I can go home till Wednesday because I, I, I don't even know how I'm going to get home. Like, I can't do stairs. There's no way I'm going to be allowed to do stairs. So I think they did talk about carrying me up the stairs into the house. So I might go home. Ambulance. I, yeah, I might have to go home by ambulance. Can you imagine going home by ambulance? Like, this is all new to me. I, this is not me. I don't lay down. Like, I don't know. It's weird. But I was kind of excited for a rest. Now I'm just raring to go. Um... I'm excited for physio to come back. So I have a physiotherapist, an occupational therapist. She will work on, she helps work on my mobility, but she also is working on getting me home. So she will order me all the equipment that I need. Like I'll have things at home, um, like maybe a commode. I'll have a walker. I have a walker. Maybe I'll we'll bring one of these. Man. Yeah. Um, she didn't say she could get me a bed, but she did talk about some other things that she could add to my bed. Um, so she'll be like the one handling if I need an ambulance to get home or whatever. And um, uh, I'll have a nurse will come and care for me and I'll be able to homeschool. <laughs> Do you think I should be a hairdresser? You think, yeah. Do you think Sophie should be a hairdresser? For horses. Uh -huh. So one thing I wanted to mention that I some of my kids are like super caregivers and some are super not caregivers. But Sophie and Nick, Sophie and Nick are total caregivers. Like they're so much like me. Like Sophie comes and she put on my socks for me. Nick is the only one, even like the nurses, that can like help me pull myself up in the bed in in a in a good way. Like I, I'm always excited for Nick to come because he helps me so much. Um, Sam finally brought me a toothbrush and um, toothpaste I was able to brush my teeth but I didn't have any pan or anything to put it in so Nick rigged up a way that I could spit back into a bottle I know that's kind of gross but yeah it's super exciting like I'm excited I'm excited to get going again all right you guys it is now 3 p.m. I've had a lot of visitors um the lady that came in to do my physio she's like you must be a really popular person you have a lot of friends and i'm like you don't even know how many friends i have because i count all of you guys as amazing friends and support i've been getting so many messages from you guys it is so amazing thank you um so the body is an amazing thing like i'm doing so well compared to yesterday with physio i progressed like 200 percent i'm actually bearing weight 
the worst injury on me is I broke both sides of my pelvis and I broke across the back of my pelvis and my tailbone. Um, it's the back of my pelvis and a little bit of my tailbone that hurts the worst. The lateral um, breaks are like healing up so fast. Guys, my second oh, it's not cap. Four. Yeah, fire. Gabby's getting addicted to caffeine. Gabby. Tonight's our bar and Christmas party. I'm really sad that I can't go. I wanted to go. I want to see Stella. I feel like until I see Stella, she's not going to know that it's okay. And I know that, that you guys are probably thinking, she's a horse. She doesn't know. But she does get scared. Like, she, they do. Like, she was confused and didn't understand. Like, um, I just feel like I need to tell her, like, it's okay and you're okay. Because I played a large part of her care. Um, so I talked to physio and... And um, people don't think I'm gonna be home for Christmas, but I'm gonna be home for Christmas. Like I told you guys that I dreamed that I um, fell off the horse, and I fell off the horse. I'm telling you now, I'm gonna be home before Christmas Eve. Um, the physio lady said that they're definitely I'm gonna have to be transported by ambulance home, which is such a weird concept for me because I never get sick. But anyway, I'm gonna say goodnight and. They're gonna go and see the horses and go to the Christmas party and then they're gonna come back. I wanna edit, like, I have so much I could be doing. I could be working and I have lots of pain meds, so I feel pretty good. Um, anyway, that's it for me for today. Um, thank you again so much for all your support. I'll be back up and at the barn. Like, the minute that I can drive, I'll be driving. And I can sit, I can sit now. So I'm like a hop, skip, and a jump away from driving. Anyway, we'll see you guys later. Bye. We should bring cupcakes. Ooh. We could bring a cupcake, too, if you want. Yeah, pick one. We'll go down and get the other desserts. Wait, are we what just we getting one pack of cupcakes? We're going to get desserts, too. We're going to go to the dessert section. We are at the grocery store to get some treats for tonight's party because we can't make a trifle that we want to make because we're too busy at the hospital. So now we're going to buy some dessert. Right. Yeah, so it's just a white blob of bison, then it's frosty the snowman. Cool. Hey, this guy's kind of like yeah. half of the icing. He does, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's go get some good treats so here. This is what I want to bring. Wait, what about the Nanimo bars? There's Nanimo bars on the bottom of that. Still, look, look at that cake. That. Look at that look cake. Look at that cake. Oh, that's a nice cake. Like okay, spider. grab one of those. That's what we're bringing. Bring it. Gabby. Here you go, Dad. Carry it. All right, let's go. You carry it. You carry it. All right, guys, we're out. It's dark. It's not even like, is it five? Oh, it's, it's five after five. five. It's 20 after five, and we're back at the dollar store just to get a few more supplies for Laura, and then we're off to a party. Yeah. Our barn party, but we're going to visit our horses first. Yes. See how they're doing. Let's tell I know that Laura's doing fine. And yes, we're going to get some more supplies. Oh, we're here at the barn. We're late. Oh, look. Oh, turn on the lights, Dad. Uh, we just want one light on. Yeah. Is that the one? Okay. Wait, Dad, what do you do for Stella? Okay, grab one. Grab two. We're at the barn. We're gonna just give uh, Stella and Storm a candy cane. Hey, you Stella. Give me candy cane. Wait. Here. It's not your fault, Stella. It's all Laura's fault. Yeah, Laura, she's in the hospital. But she's okay. Mama's doing fine. She's Mama's, your mom. Mama's doing fine. She's your mom. She's not my mom. Someone else is here. Hi, baby. Oh, I thought you would never come back. So I rolled. Oh yeah, you must have rolled in the rolled. dirt. Hey Storm. He hey Storm. Merry Christmas Storm. He Ew, you don't like the mint? He doesn't like the he mint. He gobbled up the red one. Eat it. I grabbed it. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, he doesn't want it. Doesn't want it. What? Oh, it's but. Oh no! <laughs> Wait, can we pull that off, or what do you think? Yeah, we're gonna. The stuffing's coming out. 
We need to get another blanket and that way we can change. This is a brand new blanket. I know, we need two. We're gonna have to get two blankets. That way when one gets ruined, we can switch it and then we can fix it and switch it again. Fix it. <laughs> Let's see. What is it? Just wait. Let me see it. Does it come out or? Well, this is what this, keeps this, him warm. That's, yeah, that's this part. That's what keeps him warm. So. Oh, his butt's going to be like kind of... Okay, don't pull it all out, but... No, I'm ripping it. Yeah, rip it. Rip it and we'll have to keep the fluff and fix her his blanket. No, this is not fixable. Yeah, it is. You can, you can <laughs> stuff it back in there. He's dressed up for Halloween. Wrong, wrong season for him. Okay. We get a new blanket. We take this one off. Bring we get a new blanket. We take this one off. We fix this one. All right, let's go to the party. Now you guys gotta wash your hands. Uh -huh. But I brushed my hair so good. Come on, Gabby, grab it. I'm just gonna grab one more treat. Good boy. Dad, she almost rolled on me. She's like, give me a drink of water. She wants a treat. Did you give her a treat? She had two because Gabby's oh, birthday. Okay, bye bye. Bye, Stella. We'll see you later. See you tomorrow. We'll be back tomorrow. See you tomorrow, mommy. We'll be back. Okay, so now we're going to the potluck, and um, I'm not going to vlog it. We'll be back tomorrow to, for our Sunday ride with the horses. And uh, yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with Stella because we're going to be not riding Stella, but we will be bonding with her at least. Yeah. Bond with her? Yeah. All right, let's get our treats. All right, we're back at the hospital, and look what we got. For, we brought back for Laura. Yeah. Um. Cheesecake. No, not cheesecake. Oh, no, carrot that's cake. Carrot cake. That's cheesecake. That's marshmallow thing. Marshmallow, and this is a somebody made a butter thing, and somebody made that that. I think cake. this is like a butter turret. Yeah, a little mini butter turret. Cool. Just gonna love that I stuff. Brought you some dessert. That's special and carrot cake. Oh, and then the rest, I don't know. Thanks. They got you three things and then the girl got you, brought you two. Nice. Oh. Thank you. Everyone says, hope you feel better soon and hopefully you can get back before Christmas. Yeah, have some. Then somebody yeah. recommended you get that stupid vest with the blows, that blows oh, up. I know who did that. It was, <laughs> I know who the lady who has that. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to get one of those. Maybe two of them. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.